25, I mean, you know, it's, I feel like a lot of people put a little too much into it as far as like, you know, it's, what people don't understand is that's, that is Say Cheese's uh, opinion of who that top 25 artist are. So how can you get mad at somebody's opinion? You know, uh, I mean, I really just look at it as like it's an, an enlightenment, you know, because a lot of those artists that was on there, I didn't really even know, but you know, people go on there and they listen to those people's music and they might become a fan. So it's definitely a beneficial thing to be on that list, but I feel like for the people that ain't on that list, don't act like it's the end of your career. Don't act like your career is going to end because you're not on the list. Like, you know, so, it, you know, I, niggas is just quit bitch, quit crying. You know what I'm saying? Like, niggas still get shows that ain't on that list. There's a lot of people on that list that ain't on that list that probably gonna get a deal. You know what I'm saying? So it's, it's not quit quit making everything seem like it's, it's just got I gotta do this I gotta do that. Just try to get on the Billboard's list. You know what I'm saying? Do shit like that. Niggas is gay. <laughs> Niggas <laughs> is gay to the bitch. Like you let an out of town nigga come out here. Like, niggas is looking at it the wrong way. They looking at it, that's Sean Cotton problem, that's not my problem. Nigga, this is still your city. All these niggas cry on Twitter all day about Dallas used needs to be united, blah, blah, blah. So here is a chance where you can unite as a city, take the top blogger in your city's back, you know what I'm saying, against the out-of-town ass nigga. But instead of y'all trying to stand up for a nigga that's doing something in your city, you know what I'm saying, y'all want to hop on the out-of-town ass nigga yeah. nuts. Be up there taking pictures with the nigga, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> All that kind of gay shit. Y'all niggas is on this nigga's nuts, but a nigga that's really helping a lot of artists in the city, y'all just like, fuck that nigga, that ain't got shit to do with me. That shit's gay than a bitch. But y'all want to talk about unity and putting dollars on. Why ain't dollars on? But you got a chance to, you, you know what I'm saying, to take it, the city's back. I guarantee you niggas wouldn't go out there to Baton Rouge, try to slide Kevin Gates and then pop up at a motherfucking block party in his hood later on that day. But y'all let him come out here and do this shit. But we're supposed to be Dallas Unity, Dallas Ain't On, all that kind of shit. Just <laughs> gay. Niggas is gay. I mean, cause like I like I was saying, I mean, I go off of how I was raised. You know, I was raised in a house where we were listening to, to live crew, you know what I'm saying, Uncle Luke, that kind of shit, you know, the kind of stuff that makes you get up and move, you know what I'm saying? So sometimes that doesn't, re you know, sometimes that doesn't, that doesn't necessarily require the, just the lyrics that's talking about all this subconscious stuff. I don't really listen to that. I go by my criteria when I make music is what I would listen to. And I listen to a hook, a beat, you know what I'm saying, how that person is riding that beat, the delivery. So that's really what I go by when I'm making a song. Be like, can this song get catchy enough to be in people's heads? You know, that's basically what I go off of because that's just the kind of shit that I listen to.